Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining us in this live video. Today I am really excited because we have Zoe from Super Mums. Um, Zoe is our Chief Operating Officer and in this video I'm going to share a bit about what Zoe does to help support Super Mums brand's mission and how she joined Super Mums. So Zoe, um, for those that don't know you, um, what did you do before you joined Super Mums and how did you hear about the brand? Thanks for Rachel for the introduction. So yes, so my background has all been operational management, HR, leadership roles. Um, hello, Poppet. Hello. So we all, <laughs> this is the room for moms with our children popping in at any occasion. So yeah, my background, HR and business management. Rachel, I had a great opportunity um, to move on from my career. I've been with a large, large corporate um, for 14 years. Previously to that, some small businesses, and then before that, a large corporate. Um, I really wanted to make a difference. I wanted to do something where I was impacting more on lives. Um, I wanted to really work for a nonprofit. I'd been in biz, biz, corporate businesses, and um, yeah, it, it was time for me to have a change, and a great opportunity came around. And you know what? I've got to be honest, I kind of fumbled across Super Moms. I met the very lovely Deborah um got talking to her she said do you need to come and meet heather we met in london and kind of it all just started there and that was four and a half years ago um and i haven't looked back absolutely love what i'm what i'm doing what we're doing um so yeah that, that's where it all started and we're still on the tiniest tiniest part of our mountain there is so much more i want us to do um, but yeah, we've built up a lot in the last four and a half years, thanks to the amazing colleagues and team that we've had past and present, you know, we've just got the most incredible team of people helping to support our mission. Amazing. Thanks so much. And for those that don't know, um, Zoe is the proud mum of two girls and she lives in Kent with her husband. I um, mean, she has 30 years experience in HR recruitment training, apprenticeships, operations and management. Um, so we're very lucky to be in the safe hands of Zoe as the Chief Operating Officer and um, I know that you know you're so passionate about empowering you know us as employees of the brand to really realise our potential and support us you know through coaching and um, through our feedback for the company as well which I really love and really instilling you know the values and mission of the brand. And so um, I love that Supermums absolutely lives by their brand mission of really empowering not only women in the Salesforce ecosystem, but also women within the company to have that, you know, flexible, well-paid work around their family life. And that's just a fine example of like what we do at Supermums where we <laughs> juggle, you know, work and children during the, the summer holidays. So um, I absolutely love that. So you've touched on this slightly, but what do you love most about being part of the company and the brand's mission, Zoe? So yeah, it, 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 it's a real passion, isn't it? I mean, the an example this morning, Rachel, I was busy um, welcoming a new member of the team, doing an induction, talking to her about our values and what we believe in and sharing all and then I got that from you about some feedback from a mum that you'd just come off the phone from and you were so excited that you'd spoken to this mum. And she said, you know, the money, she'd increased her salary dramatic. Within like the last seven months, she did the course February, February 22. So this year she did the course and she's already just taken a massive pay rise. She's got that flexible work she wants. Who couldn't love that? You know, listening to these stories these real life stories and when we get to the alumni events as well I mean it's just fantastic hearing those stories of people changing their lives for the better they're getting well-paid flexible work um through the sales for Sohana there's so many opportunities out there I mean how many more millions of jobs um, in the next year Salesforce are um going to be there and the lack of the lack of skilled people to do that so it's right we should be out promoting our mums and dads and getting parents to say look you can really have this flexible flexible work and and, it, and it's well paid yeah. um and for me to sort of support the team and support the business to have our teams having that flexibility as well you know so we've got um a team now across in so many different places um but but one of the members sort of 
said, I'm really struggling to get flights back. I'd like to go for at least two weeks. Um, can I can I work from from the country I'm going to? It was Spain at the time. I said, absolutely, why not? Why not just, you know, have your holiday? And then when you want to work, we can sort it out. So, yeah, so there's so much flexibility and so many opportunities that um, are just brilliant. And I love championing in that. I do it myself. You know, I love to go out for a lunchtime run. Um, tomorrow the weather's looking amazing I'm going to take the afternoon off with my girls and run to the beach for a few hours and then I can jump back online and, and do you know do a great job when I come back and I really believe that people are grateful they deserve it they can have you know you can have it all so much out of out of each other because yeah. we're happy and we've got that flexibility absolutely and you know I can't remember the exact quote but they do say like an empowered team you know they do so much more um, yes. within the time that they have and you know towards the company's brand mission when they feel that you know empowered in that environment and that's certainly something that I can echo that Supermoms absolutely does within obviously our courses and helping those women you know launch those careers in Salesforce but also for us as the Supermoms team so I'm very grateful for that so what do you feel Zoe makes um, Supermoms courses so unique for parents um, and not just you know your standard admin course like what about our course makes it so unique and perfectly positioned for parents to upskill in technology and be able to do it alongside perhaps busy careers and family life which I know a lot of our uh, women mums and parents do absolutely absolutely through listening to feedback and listening to our team you know we've we've managed to get it as flexible as we possibly can so the sessions are live sessions every week but we try and do it at a time that people tell us is the best time to do it we also record those sessions so if people can't join then it's recorded or if they want to play back it's there or if something an emergency happens and they need to run to the school to go and get the kids or the sports day or there's suddenly a presentation it's all there it's recorded um also the volunteers we match in we've got all our amazing volunteers, which I am so deeply grateful to um, because they bring so much, but we match in. So if a mum or dad would like to have a mentor in the evening, because that's what works for them, or if it's in the morning when they're dropping off at nursery, we can we can map in different time, time zones and different times suitable. Um, so we've got that. And I think also coaching. So coaching is so, so beneficial. Um, we get the opportunity to have an invite bi-weekly coaching sessions as a group but then we've also got some really incredible coaches Diane mm. Marie you know that will give one-to-one -one coaching as well so I think again and it's all done around times whether it's morning evening we've got American time zones um yeah. Amir time zones um we've got our lovely Claudia in Brazil you know we've got so we can really be flexible about that um and then obviously the work experience which again that work experience is done remotely um so all of those hours can be done around it needs to match in with the clients well but it can all be done at times to suit so you tell us when is a good time for, for you we listen and then we try and match you in yeah love that and actually for me Zoe like getting this feedback directly because I do the alumni calls and speaking to the super mums and dads and you know in particular two of the calls that I had today and one in particular where she shared she'd had that significant increased salary which for many people as an increase in salary that, you know, it's, a, it's for many that could be their full-time salary, you know, upskilling in Salesforce. But she said for her having that coaching call actually with our lovely Maria really helped her with the interview process to realize what her superpowers were. Cool. So that she could communicate that to the employers okay. and she believed that without those coaching that coaching call she wouldn't have you know been as successful in those interviews so you know what i really love having been in the company for such a short space of time is having those calls with the alumni to hear that you know the coaching the mentorship the live training sessions the training matters um, the work experience all these things encompass alongside the community that they get to be a part of you know really sets them up for success um, and it is just amazing to hear like absolutely, the impact absolutely. that it's having um, 
So I love that because I love being part of a mission-led brand. So we, um, a lot of us, obviously, Tom, he's very famous. And um, when we speak to people about super mums and the courses as one of our super dads. So Tom is Zoe's husband. Um, and if you don't mind just sharing a bit about his story, Zoe, because I know that he decided to upskill in Salesforce and he did our course. Um, what did Tom do before Absolutely. super mums? And how has that impacted your overall family life? Oh, yeah, really, really good, really, really good example. Um, that, so Tom worked in retail as a retail manager and he worked very, very long hours, very unsocial hours. You know, Christmas Day was off, but often Boxing Day certainly wasn't, you know, and Sundays, Saturdays, you know, we didn't, when we were both working for retail, different companies, different jobs, um, he, we would have maybe one day a week, every other week off together as a family um, because of working weekends and on social hours, so it'd be evenings as well. He missed so many bedtimes. He missed so many weekends, but not anymore. Um, so he decided, he was so, oh, you know, always talking about super moms and Salesforce. I need, to, I need to find out more. So I booked in a call with um, Deborah, our wonderful, wonderful Deborah, who's an ambassador now and work for us. Um, three years ago when we he decided that's it he spoke to Deborah and he said I want to tell you there's a, there's a bit of money going out the bank account I joined up super mom so sure enough he did the super mom's program and absolutely loved it really enjoyed it didn't find it easy because he's not an IT person he's really not an IT sort of person at all he's, he's a very people person he's very hands-on but but certainly never the thought of himself working on a CRM system um but he started and he really enjoyed it he met our wonderful wonderful um volunteer Andy and Andy gave him huge support as a mentor um they're still very much in touch and love meeting up um at alumni events um and yeah Tom did the course he um then got a job within Salesforce within the Sohana um and he hasn't looked back so he's been there just over two years he's been promoted um and loving the flexibility he now takes part in the school runs he does a lot of the morning drop-offs he does at least two evening drop afternoon drop-offs he can attend all the social events yeah. so and we have two days off we have weekends you know we never have weekends and he had um yeah so complete change complete change for the better he has that really well-paid flexible work Amazing. which is what we all dream about so it just makes me even more passionate to want to get other people to get yeah that that work-life balance and to get so much more absolutely because I'm such a big believer that time is our greatest gift and asset and like you know that's truly what I love about you know people being able to do that as parents and um yeah your your family is a true example of a super mums and super dads family so just, Absolutely. Um, and listen, they grow so quickly, Rachel, you blink. And I know people say it, but they are growing. You know, 10 and 12, my little girls are. How did that happen? So, um, hello, Poppy. Hello. <laughs> so, yes, some so sort it's, of it's so there. <laughs> She's baking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so important just to get that time, have that time, have that life you really do want and deserve. Yeah, for sure. Um, so what would you say to anyone, Zoe, who's maybe watching this video, um, perhaps they are completely new to Salesforce to super mums, but maybe they're starting to think of their circumstances. Maybe, you know, if you're watching this, you don't have the work-life balance that you want, the flexibility, or perhaps it's the income that you would like. What would you say to them? I think, listen, it's scary, isn't it? It's really scary, you know, and, and life isn't getting easier. You know, we're over COVID and everything. We're not, but we are through so much and, you know, money is tight. It's really hard. I know it's hard out there. But listen, you know, if you keep doing the same thing, you're going to get the same results, aren't you? Sometimes it's just be brave, maybe just take that risk. We did, we both thought, right, we're going to both go completely separate directions, you know, from, from what we've been doing. And, um, and listen, it's worked out really well, but it's not just our story. It's so many people's stories, isn't it, Rachel? You just hear so much. But I think, yeah, it's, it's difficult, but um, investing in yourself and look, at, look into Salesforce, look at what they're forecasting, look at the jobs that they have got, that look how much they're growing, you know, 
and just do that little bit of homework and then also look at some of the case studies you know we've got you don't have to be a real technical person salesforce is just incredible you know what a crm system and look at the backgrounds from out you know we've got teachers we've got so many different industries we've got hairdresser solicitor lawyers you know look at the people that have have, have amazing people that have done the done our training course and and look at where they are now and what they're doing and there are so many great examples so maybe just take that take that take that jump go for yeah, it you can absolutely. do it absolutely i would agree and i would just say to anyone who's watching this um, i'll drop a link in the comments of this video to the section on our website of what is a salesforce career you can sign up yeah. to one of our five day challenges yeah. and that way you can actually see what the day in the life of a salesforce admin would look like but also just know like the, the admin um, course is our entry level foundational course it gets your foot in the door to salesforce however it doesn't necessarily mean that you'll start at that foundational level so for instance one of our super moms who i spoke to today she did our admin course february earlier this year on and on september 1st she starts her salesforce consulting role role for a german company and she shared with us this morning that she's had a twenty-two thousand pounds salary increase since starting um, and obviously upskilling in sales force and she'll be starting that new career in september so obviously life-changing income progression she's been able to relocate her and her family to germany which she wanted to do because that's where her family are from so i would just say to anyone look into our case studies look at our stories and the doors open for everyone like one thing that i have loved is the diversity of people and everybody comes from different backgrounds but also what i love about the salesforce industry in ohana is they take into consideration your skills prior to salesforce so whether that be your life skills as a mother so i, I believe as mums we have negotiation and multitasking skills like Definitely. none other <laughs> um but also you know your skills Definitely. beforehand in your previous career so yes um i have loved doing these interviews and just shining the light on our team because i truly believe like zoe we have such a talented team at super mums of unique mm -hmm. and just individual women with different skills and i really enjoy the fact that as a team we get to bring our our skills and our opinions and you know different strengths to the table and that really makes you know super mums the incredible company that it really is so thank you so much for sharing all that you do and in um, supporting the mission you're and, welcome um, you're welcome i think i think just one of yeah just one other thing as well just to you know the recruitment business as well so the recruitment side the team there are so knowledgeable you know and again look at some of the um feedback that we've got from them and just look at how much support the recruitment team can do there is so much experience there and we've even got clients you know that say they purposely want a mom or a dad because they just know they can they're so good at multi-skilling and they're so good at that flexibility and, and and the negotiation skills and a lot of what you say um yeah so i just wanted to add that part as well thank yeah. you rachel for your yeah. time absolutely thanks so much and yes if um if you're already in the sales for ecosystem but you know looking to progress further then as we mentioned there we have our um recruitment and consulting team who help place um professionals in the salesforce ecosystem as well so that's another arm of what we do at super mums um and just as a company i believe we've got so much to offer and um, yeah thanks for your time today zoe if you've got any questions for either thanks. of us you can pop it in the comments below or feel free to reach out to us and send us a message but thank you for listening and have a good day bye